These hoes all the same They callin' my name Cause Super's got the fame Oh no, she's dealing not again I'm kidding, alright, let's get it Let's get it, alright I fuck with a tender bitch aroused Yet I'm still a strip I've struggled, I'm fucking rich But my dick is hella limp Mushroom top, make that pussy bleach You want me to stop? I'm like, nah, I'ma keep going Till you're on your knees, huh? Fuck that bitch, she's screaming out this shit But I'm like, nah I'ma make that finger trigger itch Ay, yeah I'ma keep going And I'm flowing No sound If I ever let you down I'm sorry If I ever made you cry Yo, 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 what is up, boys and girls? I know, I know not many girls watch this But some of you guys do Some girls do watch this, okay? So highly requested, my intros need to be some parodies of a famous beat. You know this one. Shout out to Juice World, Lucid Dreams. You know, have you guys listened to his uh, his album? Juice World, he's on the come up. He was like, he's low key a YouTuber, and then he dropped some music. Now he's he's on the come up like Lil Xan, Lil Skies. You know, all those all those new wave people. I'm about to hop on the wave too. Okay. Just wait for it, just wait for it. All right, so today's a very special day. I'm going to be introducing a new segment of my channel called Two Minute Tuesdays, Three Minutes. I'm not sure, really sure how long it'll be, but you'll see it. And this is where I'm just gonna go over, like reviewing, reacting to genius rappers, reacting to their own song meanings. You know, some of the stuff they be saying is pretty, pretty stupid. Like it's just self-explanatory and they still gotta go over it. So without further ado, let's hop right into it. Hope you guys enjoy. And just a disclaimer before y'all start hating, I know my lyrics aren't always super meaningful either, but it, it depends on the vibe, you know? If you're trying to bang out, you can't be rapping about emotional heartbreak shit, you know what I'm saying? No, I gotta be rapping about getting that money, doing drugs, drinking, you know, all the stereotypical rapper things. Do not condone it, kids do not drink. Do not do drugs, okay? Hey, first rapper up, we got Lil Xan. You guys know the song Betrayed, right? Xan's gonna make you Xan. Yeah, yeah. That one, that one. We're gonna be reviewing what he says on Genius. Let's go. Let's it's go. a funny story. When I was a little kid, I thought I was like the second coming of like Jesus. And second coming of Jesus, boy? I don't think Jesus has tattoos like that. What are you talking about? Alright, let's keep going. Instead of being the second coming of Jesus, I became like a somewhat popping rapper. So I guess it's like a little... Emphasis on somewhat. Okay, you got like one, two songs tops that are good. Okay. He's about to fall off. He's about to fall off. Not hating, but he's not the best rapper out there. Okay, like Lil Skies, he actually has skills. Okay. Juice World, he's actually has, he actually has skills too. But Lil Xan, listen to his other stuff. Name, comment down three songs with Juice World. No, Lil Xan. My bad. Lil Xan. The fine line, it's, you know. I was painfully addicted to Xan's for like two years of my life, so. Yeah, you look like it, you fucking close eyes motherfucker. I'm just kidding, that's me. <laughs> Anybody trying to tell me I'm a poser can shut the fuck up. I know what it's like to be addicted to that. I was lucky enough to get off that shit. Wait a minute. So it looks like he's like 18, 19 tops. So if you're addicted to Zans for two years. What, you start in like eighth grade, boy? <laughs> Pop the chunk of open up. I sold my soul a good price. I'm not a devil worshiper. Uh, Might as well believe be. believe I sold my soul for a good price. Uh I, you know, I'm, I'll, I'll leave that up for interpretation, you know, and I'll let the people think what they want to think. Okay, Out okay. Out of sight of my whole got talent, right? Whole squad ran through that shit, yikes. No, 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 no. Why would you let your squad smash your girl? What the fuck? Nah, bro. If she's mine, she's mine. No, I'm not letting my homie smash. She's my girlfriend, I'm protecting her. No, I ain't sharing. See why these dudes want to take pics me. Uh, you know, that's just being in the limelight a little bit, I guess. You know, I love so I'm trying to be not. like, ha, ha, ha. like anybody who supports me, I, I rock with them. Says she gay, still in me. Says she gay, still in me. Life, how the fuck is she gay? Still into you. Last time I checked, gay means 
attracted to the same sex. So, 2 plus 2 equals Lil Xan has a vagina. That's what it is. Lil Xan is a pussy. Zans don't make you. Zans gon' take you. Zans gon' fake you. And Zans gon' betray you. Zans don't make you. Let's get that. Let's get that. I was doing Narcos. Yeah, dude. Stay off Zans, kids. Stay off that hard stuff. Yeah. And they're pussy tits like Skittles. Hey. Hey. Skittles. Hey. Hey. You can really taste the rainbow. What? I, you know what? I have not told a girl that, but I would feel like the corniest dude if I... How does pussy taste like rainbows? Skittles? What does rainbows taste like? Skittles. Skittles rainbows. Hmm. Yeah. If I ate pussy that tastes like Skittles... Damn. I wouldn't need... This or this, no more. I wouldn't. I just wouldn't. If that shit tasted good, oh, whew, that's a game changer. Please, girls, start putting some Skittles down there. Help a brother out. If I was just, you know, like if I told a girl at this point, I would feel corny. I've not had a pussy taste like Skittles, but I've had a pussy taste sweet before. I really miss my mistress. The the rap game crazy, you know, like. Uh, See, I feel like you don't need to explain that lyric right there. It's pretty self-explanatory. There's no inner meaning of it. All right, keep keep going, Lozan. A lot of women come into your life, and, you know, it's hard to say no sometimes. So uh, I think a lot of rappers have, quote-unquote, mistresses that they don't like to talk about. But well, fuck it, I'm going to talk about it, because why not? Six, six, six evil bitches want my mention. All right, guys. Well, that basically wraps up the video. If you guys haven't noticed, I got a fresh new haircut and I uh, touched up my roots again. You know, transforming into that Super Saiyan God. You know, Super Saiyan up here, Super Saiyan like one or two right here. Super Saiyan God's coming up, okay, baby. Comment down below. What's your guys' favorite Dragon Ball Z transformation? This is anybody. You can be Gohan, Mr. Gohan, Ultimate Gohan. I fucks with Gohan if you can't tell. Anything. Golden Frieza. You know what? Comment down below, what's your guys' favorite Dragon Ball Z transformation? Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to be posting something like this every every week, hopefully. I'll be reacting. Yeah, two minute Tuesdays. Three, I don't even know how long this video is going to be. Shit. All right, boys. Peace out. Super Saiyan Sue. Deuces.